Aviat Vigatel's PS-90 engine series is a major development in Soviet aviation technology. The PS-90 was initially developed in the late 1980s to satisfy the increasing demand for more environmentally benign and efficient engines for a new generation of Soviet airliners. The engine's development represented a departure from the traditional Soviet designs, as it integrated contemporary features such as high bypass ratios, full authority digital engine control, and advanced materials that improve performance and reduced emissions. The PS90A, the initial variant, was certified in 1992 and has been used to power a variety of aircraft, such as the Tupolev Tu-204 and Ilyushin L-96. The PS90 A1 and A3 engines are especially noteworthy among the numerous modifications of the PS90. PS90 A1 was designed to enhance efficiency and reliability in comparison to its predecessor, while PS90 A3 introduced additional improvements in economic performance and durability. A significant advancement within the PS90 engine family, the PS90 A1 variant was developed specifically for the Ilyushin 1L96-400T transport aircraft. This turbofan engine, which was introduced in 2007, is distinguished by its superior performance and sophisticated engineering compared to its predecessors. The PS90A1 boasts a maximum thrust rating of 17,400 kg force, approximately 171 kN, which represents an improvement over the original PS90A's thrust capabilities. This improvement enables the engine to effectively support heavy cargo operations, rendering it appropriate for long-haul missions. The PS90A1 is a high-bypass turbofan engine with twin spools that employs a diverse array of contemporary technologies to enhance efficiency and mitigate environmental impact. It uses a low-emission combustor to reduce hazardous emissions while ensuring reliable performance. Furthermore, the PS90A1 is equipped with second-generation noise suppression systems, which enable it to operate in accordance with international noise regulations. The engine's durability and endurance are enhanced by the use of advanced materials, including heat-resistant intermetallic alloys and ceramic thermal barrier coatings. The PS90A3 is the Russian domestic equivalent of the PS90A2. Aviadvigatel and Pratt & Whitney engaged in a substantial collaboration to develop the A2 variant, which is a sophisticated derivative of the PS90 engine series. The PS90A2 was built through a redesign that integrated a variety of Western technologies and components from countries including the United States, France, Germany, and Sweden. The PS90A2 was engineered to optimize performance and minimize maintenance expenses, resulting in a 40% decrease in operational expenses when compared with its predecessors. The PS90A2's enhanced full-authority digital engine control system is one of its most significant attributes as it enhances engine reliability and performance. The engine's thrust specification is approximately 16,000 kg force, 157 kN, which is comparable to that of the original PS90A. However, it is capable of producing up to 18,000 kg force, 176 kN, when necessary. This adaptability enables its implementation in a variety of aircraft configurations, rendering it appropriate for contemporary airliner designs. Contemporary fuel consumption standards are met by the PS90A2 in terms of operational efficiency, which is comparable to Western engines. It is also noteworthy for being the first Russian engine to be certified for ETOPS, Extended Range Twin Engine Operational Performance Standards, with a rating of 180 minutes, which significantly enhances its operational capabilities for long-haul flights. Furthermore, the engine's noise levels are below the current regulatory threshold, thereby ensuring that it complies with international aviation standards. The A3 version was built by the Russians using the lessons learned from the A2 program as the engine necessitates the U.S.'s approval for production. Nevertheless, the primary reason for the lack of orders for both variants is the limited number of aircraft that can use them, despite these improvements. The current market dynamics suggest that there are no significant initiatives on the horizon that would necessitate the use of these engines in significant quantities.
This situation is further exacerbated by financial constraints at UEC Perm Motors, which has resulted in a prioritization of resources toward more promising developments. The PD-14 engine has become a focal point for UEC Perm Motors, surpassing the PS90A1 and A3. The PD-14 is engineered to meet the performance requirements of the modern aviation industry, including the MC-21, and is intended to power the new generation of Russian aircraft. It is evident that this engine will surpass prior models, such as the PS-90 series, as development advances. The PD-35, which is also imminent, is expected to offer even greater efficacy and capabilities. It is anticipated that this next-generation engine will surpass not only the PS90 series, but also the PD-14. The PS90, A1, and A3 engines are technologically significant accomplishments for Russian aviation. However, their future is uncertain as a result of a lack of orders and a decreasing relevance in an industry that is increasingly centered on modernization. The PS90 variants are expected to experience a further decline in production as UEC Perm Motors concentrates on the development of engines such as the PD-14 and PD-35. This transition to more modern technologies that are more in line with the current market requirements is evidenced by this development. Now, do you think PS90 engines are becoming increasingly irrelevant? Let us know in the comments. Please like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel. Please also take membership in our channel to encourage us.